What is up guys? Can I get in today? Back with a brand new episode of Skyrim Special Edition Mod Showcases on my channel. Hopefully guys are having a banger of a day and today we are going to be covering the Assassin Creed Rogue. Quite a few of these coming out of the channel. Assassin Creed Rogue Armors. But I have no fear, they are coming to a slight end. I just wanted to cover them just because they are absolutely damn beautiful. But today we're going to be doing the Assassin Creed Rogue Sharpshooter Outfit. Absolutely beautiful that's for damn sure guys as always if you want this mod it is down in the description below make sure you go and click those links and grab this mod because it's absolutely awesome loving the textures through this mod as well we've covered many of this author's mods before and they've been absolutely spot on every single time so once you've installed this mod you are ready to go head over to any forge and you will find the four properties of armor which is going to be the main sort of chest bit of the main outfit the hat, gauntlets, and the boots, and they can all be sort of made underneath the faction of leather. So that's exactly what we're going to do. So we're going to run over to our forge here, our trusty forge. Apologies that I am naked. And head over into our leather section, and we are going to grab this, guys. If you see any mods that you like on screen, let me know, and I will bung you a comment. But nine times out of ten, you can actually just easily find them within on the channel. So, Sharpshooter's helmet, again, looks primarily kind of like the fact of it's going to be a leather-based suit as again. And what I mean by that is pretty much primarily requirement made off of leather, which is pretty damn cool. So, the Sharpshooter's hat looks pretty damn cool. I love the little, little flick on the side there. That's cool. It's going to be an armor value rating of 81. Weight of 3, which is freaking nothing, which is absolutely great. So, we're going to grab one of those. Let's go down here with the Sharpshooter's outfit. This is a massive armor jump as well, especially due to the other ones as well. It's a little bit more padded out, so it does make sense. And I do love that as well, that they take that in consideration. It's going to be 384 armor value rating there. 10 leather to make this, so get on your leather grind and grab this. Weight of 10, which is pretty damn good, actually. Really good. So we're going to grab that as well. And then we're going to head down and grab the rest of this. Okay, guys, I think that's it, to be totally honest. I think it was just sort of the fact of I couldn't find the other four set, the actual four pieces to the set. All I could find here was literally just the sharpshooter's hat and the sharpshooter's outfit. Very strange. I can't actually find the gauntlets or the boots. It's going to be very, very strange. Okay, it's fine. We're, 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 we'll roll with that. I don't think it's included within there. Some mods do obviously equip the boots with it in general, so it might not be too bad. But let's, uh, let's bung on the hat and the alpha. I don't know why I can't find the other two. They should be located within the leather faction as well. Oh, we do have boots on. Oh, it is an entire thing. Oh, I know what it means now. It's a class as a four set piece, so you get all the bonuses as well. But obviously, the gauntlets and the boots are included within the chest armor as a whole. So, we should have said outfit more than just chest. I think it says outfit. What does it actually say? It says outfit. Yeah, okay, so it does include everything. Okay, it's not too bad. So, obviously, two bits to create there. It's obviously a little bit lower requirement cost for you guys to make that entirely. So, uh, that is really nice. So. 81 for the helmet, it's pretty easy, and 384 for the entire rest of the armor. That includes gauntlets, boots, and main armor set itself. Pretty damn good, not gonna lie. 490 armor value rating for in total. I look like a freaking badass, not gonna lie, especially with the beard and the hair. Kind of reminds me of a Chuck Norris kind of thing, especially with the scars as well. Definitely an Assassin's Creed Chuck Norris going on here. That's absolutely awesome. So Assassin's Creed Rogue Sharp outfit. Sharp shooter outfit. Let's have a little look at the camera angles as well. Let's look from the back. Again, they're, they're, there's, I can't fault these armors at all. Like, never. There's no clipping issues. There's no texture issues. They're just absolutely beautiful. And they're all from the same mod author as well. Never. I just can't get enough. They're absolutely beautiful. Just the amount of detailing. Like, even with the, like the little sort of pixelated. And it's not really pixelated. I don't know how to describe it. It's like really. It's pixelated because it's it's textured like that. Like an actual leather belt running. The leather strap running across our chest there. I might not be able to do it justice on camera now. Actually, I tell you what I can do. I can zoom right in, which I'm going to do as well. I'm going to zoom right in, and we're actually going to have a look at all these textures. So let's go field of view. Let's go 50. There we go. Let's have a, let's have a little better look here. Look at that. The one running on the chest there actually looks like leather. That's a really nice set of armor. Again, I can't fault it for any, even like the sleeves. The sleeves of the material coming out there of the actual shirt, again, is absolutely awesome. 
the cravat across the neck as well that looks great a little bit of a clipping there but it will but it just flows beautifully with the neck movements of the uh the character itself just in general really really nice look at the bottom as well got some crisp boots there i love it when people actually have their own boots which is great it's kind of a high higher sort of a lift boot there which is pretty damn cool that's awesome i mean i can't fault this at all the only thing i could suggest if you're going to run around with possibly Maybe a dagger or two, or even a really short sword. But uh, for me, I'd probably run around with a musket, if I'm perfectly honest with this outfit. Just because it looks definitely musket-worthy. Or even just a one-hander. Possibly. I don't know, two short swords would be absolutely great. I'm going to stop waffling about on my opinions. Let's get back to it. So obviously, all we need to do now is see what the sort of uh, upgrade requirements are going to be on this set of armor as well. It's kind of good to see that there's only sort of two bits to upgrade for a full suit, which is obviously going to be the hat and the armor as well. So the sharpshooter, the sharpshooter, sharpshooter hat is going to go from 81 to 219. Now, hold up a second, and you're probably thinking, how the hell did you get from that massive leap to that? The, the This armor is going to be absolutely insane. Like, ready 384 to 806. Like, that, no way. That's impossible for one lever to go to a legendary status of that. Well, I'm actually running a mod, and it actually alters the perks. I think it's called Odin's Perk. Correct me if I'm wrong. If you do want a link to that, just comment and I will throw you a link to it. The actual link for the mod that I'm on about. I'm pretty sure it is cool with that though. And it actually changes all the perk trees within the game. And obviously the one that we're talking about and focusing on the moment is going to be the smithing perk as well. That's why it is a massive jump. Just as a small disclaimer in there. So 806, so we're going to create that one. And 81 to 293 for the hat. So it's well over a thousand armor rating, which is absolutely great. It's just for... Something that practically weighs nothing, 13 weight on the chest, and it actually cost hardly nothing to create as well for an armor value of 1,124. Guys, for a beautiful set of armor here, a really highly de textured and detailed as well. Highly recommending, as I say, with a short sword, daggers, or even a musket download, which will be down in the description below. Really worth it. And as well, I look like Chuck Norris, so what could be better? Guys, if you did enjoy this video, hit me up with a like. Let me know in the comment section below what you think of this armor as well. I personally think it's absolutely awesome. There's no faultage on any of this author's mods. Absolutely beautiful. Guys, until the next one, Killer Kev here and Killer Kev out.